Hello and welcome to me and my golf TV. You've joined us on our USA Golf Breaks Tour. We're at Southern California, Newport Beach, Pelican Hill. Andy, we're on the north course. What a fantastic place fantastic. this is. Now, you can't see, but they've got the ocean behind us. We're on the 15th hole here. Match me versus Pierce. We Different are clothes. all square at the moment. Different clothes as well. Different clothes, Make sure yeah. you check out part one. Check out part one, it's going to be a great match. We've had two fantastic holes. These, these two are going to be even better. This looks awesome. Hope you enjoy, guys. Right then, Andy, back to all square. Sneaky birdie on you there. Sneaky birdie. <laughs> Tee shot deserved it. <coughs> right, 445 yards, par 414, uh, 15, sorry. North course here at Pelican Hill. Straight it's to the a beauty, dog legs round to the left. Straight at this bunker here. 300 yards to reach that, so maybe at that with a slight bit of draw. Let's see what he's got. It. It's just on the right side. It should be fine, that should. Wind into a little bit, yeah, that should be cut. good. A little cut there, so it's short. Yeah. Alright, it's a safe one. It's a safe one, but not a great one. Safe one, but not a great one. Poet, and you didn't know it. Right, Pierce. Quite wide fairway, that one, really. I've left myself a, a bit of a long shot in from there. Yeah, going to be a bit long. Need to get a bit it? more, uh, a bit of a stronger flight into this breeze. Strong flight, but it's going a little left, sort of coming down behind that bunker to the left there, guys. Just a little too much uh, right to left on that one. Not sure what's over there, but I think I think it opens out past that bunker. Cooked a little, could be really good or it could be really bad. Guess which one I'm hoping for. So, guys, so just uh, take a look at the scenery we've got around us here. If we look over there, we have uh, Newport Beach over there and then we have Huntington Beach a little bit further on and then if we just sort of give you a little bit of a pan around here obviously just a great view here look at the sea a couple more holes just to, to the left of us here doing a little bit of work on it and then also see down there what we have is uh, Crystal Cove down there and some fantastic beautiful you have the resort just over there as well Pelican Hill Resort which we had dinner in last night which was amazing and some uh, nice houses scattered around the place so really is a beautiful place to be here make sure you check out our daily vlog which we did here show the experience okay Andy so yours obviously just got hung up a bit on the right of course you've got a long way left in 215 yeah 215 yeah just a fade against the wind there a fade against the Not wind into the slope landing as well it probably probably went about a, a yard forward when it hit the ground so Okay, so I've got four iron here. Okay. Again, wind sort of into and off the right. Green you can see there. Flag pretty accessible. Right in the middle. Getting it at the right, drawing it in. Is it going to draw enough? Yeah, it's a good shot. It's a very good shot. Solid strike, solid shot. Still moving, still moving. Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? But it's actually probably coming away now, isn't it? Yeah, hold it there, hold it. Sorry about that, cameraman. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Oh. So yeah, ball above. And wind into and off the right. So Andy, you were making sure that was starting well right, weren't you? Yeah, it was, uh, it was always going to work its way back in that one. Had to start well right. Good effort, bottom. Okay, so Pierce is actually was pretty good. Difficult to see, but opened out a lot here. Pierce has uh, took the tiger line, he's got 161 left uphill into the breeze on a bit of an upslope here as well. Yeah, I've just changed club, I was going eight, but I'm going seven now because of the breeze and uh, the breeze has stopped. Upslope, as you say, I'll still be a bit there. Yeah. There's definitely a tier we want to get it all the way up there as well, so yeah. I think the seven's a good play. It's nice, it's nice. Not sure where that came down, Pierce. Never touched the green, Andy. You gone big? Straight through the back. Straight through the back. 
Is it too good? Yeah, and I think I'm gonna have a rather tricky shot from down there. <laughs> there now. Oh, wow. Okay, so mine there came off the bank and just carried on down. I got a real long putt there, up the green. Huge green here, all the way up to this flag. And we'll see Pierce's here now was really probably 10 yards too big. And he's just got now, he's left with a tricky shot all downhill to the flag. Not much green to work with is probably a good thing though because the fringe should slow it down a little bit. So yeah, I'm not sure how it's going to react it. Once it gets on the surface, it's all away. All downhill, so. Played it really good, played it really good. Stop, stop. And you know what? Look at that. So, I don't really think you could have played it much different to that pace. And that is ran on and ran on. I thought that, I thought that was gonna be close. That was tough. I thought that was gonna be close. Okay, so Andy is there. He's aiming here, off the green, and the flag is here. I don't even know what he's got to do here. I think he's got to put it off the green. He's definitely looking that way. This will be an amazing two putt. So he's up, here he comes. Not quite off the green. Here it comes round, here it comes round, here it comes round. And then like mine, off it goes. Do you ask? Probably. I'd class that as a very good shot. Do you know what? I probably needed to hit it off the green on that one. I think you did. I think it needed to actually come off the green here by that sprinkler head. And then maybe grab and slow down. But you could have got the lob wedge and just pitched it up by the yeah, hole from there. Yeah. That's that was uh, really not a bad effort. Not a bad effort. Okay, so this is coming straight back up the hill. Quite a severe hill this, so it's probably going to be a little slow, a little bit off the left as well, it's going to move from left to right. See my marker there. Just move that because it was on his line. It's a safe par. Oh god, great putt, great effort. Had the line. Right, oh dear. At least you've helped me out with the line a little bit. Yeah. That Looked good. Thought yeah, I got it. Tracking. Difficult to get that one to the hole based on the seeing how fast the greens are though. But you know what? Yeah, you're hitting it all uphill and it's just got a slope at the back here of this. That's ridiculous. Mm, okay. Okay, take that away. Thank you. I, uh, I, I'm looking at this here now, Andy. I actually think, if you look at that where the flag is now, yeah. if you'd have whacked your ball up the right, I reckon it could have, even if it was here, I think it would have come down to the flag. Probably not quite as severe to get it moving all the way down there, but see it is, uh, it's, it's quite severe. <laughs> Oh, you, what? you never know. Tell you what. You know what to do next time you play Pelican Hill then, if you're watching. Knock it close. <laughs> Knock it. Don't, <laughs> Knock don't, it don't miss the, the green hole. right. <laughs> green hole, 156. Beautiful looking par three. And he's coming in, it's into the wind and off the left, so you're going with a seven, I believe. It's only half there, Pierce, on the last one, wasn't it? It'd be a good, hit, hit good shot on everyone and came off with the bogey. That's how tricky that green was. I think he was saying that was a seven iron, yes. Uh, yeah, it was Andy, wasn't it? It was a very tricky green. Okay, right. Again, right we then. can see past the flag here, another slope. So Yeah, we've got a tier at the back of the green. Let's have a look at that again. So you'll see, hopefully on camera, you'll see there's a tier behind the green. So go back stop. Okay. Back stops could provide very useful here for the hole in one category. Leaf 
taking a bit to the right. Ooh. Ooh. A little strong as well. A little bit over there on the right, so I think I might have missed that one there. But yeah, a bit strong. It's going to make me hit an 8 iron, that's for sure. It is, yeah. You're going to learn from that one, Pierce. <laughs> Sorry for going first. Oh, so a window of opportunity there, Andy, hitting 7 iron. Maybe the 8 iron was the right club. But that's great news for me. But having said that, he did strike the golf ball really well. So we're going to show you with this analysis how he struck the golf ball so well, specifically looking at how he uses the ground on his iron shot. So we can see as he gets to the top of his backswing, he's got a fantastic wind-up, very stable lower body. But what Andy does really well from here is he uses the ground now to push his energy through towards the target. So you can see his lower body, the lead hip, gets onto the red line very, very quickly. And then from there, the lead shoulder, the left shoulder, also gets onto that red line. You can see he's got a tremendous amount of lag in the arm and the shaft there. That's really going to help him when it comes to this ball, then divot strike. But all he's got to do from here now, because he's shifted his weight so well and got his pressure over onto his lead side, all he's got to do now is he's got to turn his body. So you can see his body turning, it's unwinding toward the target. Now you often see in magazines these picture-perfect positions when people strike the golf ball. This could not get any better. You can see that his right leg is released from the green line, as we mentioned, but his left arm, his left leg, and his whole left side are in a virtual straight line. So when he's striking the golf ball, the shaft is leant forward. And if you actually look at this when he swings through, you'll see a puff of uh, dust, the divot, as Andy strikes the ground, comes up there. You're not going to get much better than that through the golf ball. So again, what can you learn from this? Get into a great backswing if you can, but the most important thing is that you get a good start to your downswing, good transition. That's going to allow you to strike the golf ball like Andy Proudman. But that may not matter though, because I'm going to hit eight iron now and hopefully hit it closer. Okay, eight iron for you then, Piss. Yes. We know that's going to be the club. I think so. I hope so. I really, 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 really hope. <laughs> All right. It's going in the same direction as mine. Sit down then. And just a little shorter than mine, so slightly safer. Just, uh, I think we've got some very tricky chips out down there. <laughs> well, let's just give ourselves <laughs> another one of these ridiculously hard chips. There we go. It's all downhill from there as well. It is all downhill for you. Yes, you're right. Right, so he's pulled a good lie, big and right. But that's the least of his worries because once he hits here, it is all down like this, all the way, all the way, all the way past me. So he's got to aim far enough right, get on the top level almost. He's well right, he's well right, he's well right. That's a really good shot, but look at that. That's just down to... You know what, if we play here again, you make sure you don't go there. All I'd say, Pierce, is good luck. Thanks for that. <laughs> good luck. So it's, it's pretty much impossible to get it. It actually, actually needs to hit the hole to actually have any chance of getting even close. Oh, nice. So Pierce has just checked that against there. And that's probably, you know what, that's as good as he could have done from there without hitting the hole. It's crazy, isn't it? And you played that perfect. Loads of rip on it as well, didn't you, that? Played that perfect. Loads of check. This hole, this hole's just making us look a little silly, Pierce. Why don't we hit the green? That would probably be better. There we are, yeah. <laughs> it's our fault. It's not my fault. It can't be. So we just discussed off camera there that we should hit it past the hole and see what happens. I think Andy's just changed his mind. Okay, so obviously we know what's going to happen. Coming left to right, it's up the hill. Could be in. Oh, I want to put down, that would be. Come on, come back. Do you know what? It's coming back. Here it comes, here come it back. comes, here it comes, here it comes. Ah. Interesting. To left to right up the hill, as you can see from mine. The thing is, if he's going to go past it, he needs to aim more left, so. Mm -hmm. I doubt he'd be going for there. He's going to be going for the hole. I'm definitely going to be going left anyway. It's gone left. Starts to break. Oh, yeah, pretty safe. Pretty safe. Quickly get it, Pierce. I'll, I'll give you that one. Oh, it's moving. 
<laughs> I didn't even see it moving. Actually, I won't give you that one. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it had stopped. <laughs> right then, Andy, this is actually for a very good bogey. I'll be, I'll be happy with it. <laughs> After my second shot there. I really... F good Ooh. shot, good shot, well done. I really feel like we're doing a public service, aren't we, to people who come and play Pelican Hill. They know exactly where not to miss the green now, don't they, on the last two holes. Just just keep it short on this one, guys. I think so. Pierce, I'm going I'm to give you that one. Oh, yeah. I'm going to give you some very generous. Pierce obviously wanted just to finish it off anyway. He's going to feel like he's got, I think he's he's got one over on the whole thing. I think end. he's rescinded that on me, I think, that they give him. No, it's fine with me, Pierce, that is. Fine with me. So what you've got to do now is you've got to stay in tune Stay tuned, stay in tune, or stay in tune if you're singing, but stay tuned to part three. We're going to show you even more crazy, ridiculous, not up and downs. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed part two of our course vlog and our match here at Pelican Hill on the north course. This is testy pace, isn't it? This is <laughs> testing our putting skills, short game skills, for sure. The next hole, I'm going to really think about where I'm going to put my I'm shot I'm definitely going to think about, yes, hitting the green in the right place. That would be helpful. Post your comments down below what you think about this, guys, and also subscribe to the channel for more videos every single week, just here. Also, make sure you check out the rest of the videos we've done on this uh, amazing tour. We're very lucky with what we're doing, but check out the daily vlog here. This is actually showing you where we stayed in the villa and showing you the rest of the facility. You Beautiful place. You will love it. Thanks for watching, guys. See you Cheers. soon. See you in part three. <laughs>